Good morning, I'm Tony Snyder with Midwest Outdoors in International Falls. We're hunting grouse and woodcock with my friends Tom Wooden and Willie Lyon. Let's go see if we can find some birds. Nice cool morning out here. Really good for uh, the dogs get to scent. It's moist, it's cold. Yep, and they can run a long while. So we're looking forward to some more hunting. That's grouse droppings, where a grouse has been on that log drumming and uh, spent a lot of time, and one of the, the telltale signs of grouse in the area. Somebody's got to shoot it. What in the point? Can't, everybody can't get, you know, it doesn't fly for everybody. I'm real happy we got a grouse. It's some of the best tasting uh, game birds there are. It's a uh, wonderful all white meat, just, just tremendous uh, table fare. Beautiful bird in a brown face. See the feathers are brown. High. He, he doesn't know exactly where it is, but he smells a bird. He doesn't know where it is, though. Good shot. Another one. Another woodcock. Woody did his job. We got it, didn't we, Woody? Good boy. Wow. One woodcock. Lucky enough to uh, be able to connect with it. Beautiful point flush and shot. Uh, if you'll notice, we're all using side-by-side -side, uh, shotguns, a very traditional uh, shotgun for grouse and woodcock hunting. Uh, this happens to be a Parker shotgun made in about 1932. Uh, very traditional uh, use for, for uh, woodcock and grouse for a lot of years. A lot of walking involved, as, as you've seen, uh, a lot of breaking through the woods and a lot of really tight forests you have to hunt through when you're woodcock and grouse hunting. Yeah, you better have a good pair of gloves and some shooting glasses to protect your eyes and, and hands from uh, being all cut up from run, going through the woods. Come here. Do I get it? Yep. <laughs> Tell the story. Well, it just started to take off and I shot at it and was lucky enough to connect. That was kind of cool sitting there. I mean, that don't happen very often. The dog goes on point, the bird's on a log, two feet off the ground. Bird jumped down off the log, started running through the woods, and we had to catch up to take it. off. Grouse! Bring it here, good boy! Bring it here! There he is. The king of bird game birds. The rough grouse. Yeah, a red faced one. Rusty. Oh, what a beautiful bird. Yeah. What a battle. There were two in there. The dog went on point. I shot at the one who got up further away, missed it, and then this one came up. He went a point again, actually, and this one was much closer. 
it was kind of sandwiched in between us or something. Yeah, I never went with the first one, so that's that's exciting right there. Hey guys, we had a great day today in the, in the grouse woods here in International Falls, which is a great place if you're an outdoor enthusiast year round to have fun. Uh, you can fish in the summer for walleyes, bass, northerns, all kinds of species. You can hunt in the fall. You can combine them and hunt and fish. Shoot grouse and woodcock, snowmobile in the winter. It's just a wonderful destination for the outdoor enthusiast. I'm Tony Snyder with my friend Tom Wooden and Willie Lyon. Midwest Outdoors, we'll be right back.